Hi friends, welcome back to another Mina Monday. This week's video is actually a productive day in my life. I am hoping that it is as productive as my last video was. I have to do my accounting class and then I have my digital arts foundations class. After that, I have a little break, so I'm gonna be eating some lunch. Then I have my management information systems class and then a meeting. And then I'm gonna make a canvas with one of my friends for my painting class. And then I have to study a lot because midterms is next week and on Wednesday I have two back-to-back -back midterms. Literally like the classes are right after one another so it's like really like just back-to-back. -back. I just hop from one midterm to another which is gonna be so fun I'm sure. <laughs> Anyways um, please let me know what you think of this video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below and let's just get on to the rest of it. Today's breakfast is actually overnight oats, so I'll insert the clip of how to make this right now. To make this wonderful breakfast, you'll need coconut milk, rolled oats, some chia seeds, honey or agave nectar, peanut butter, and some cinnamon, and whatever toppings like medjool dates or fruits that you want. And then you'll want to put those all in a cup or a mason jar if you have one. You will want to start with half a cup of oats, and then you'll want to put half a cup of coconut. I like it to be a little bit less thick, so I put just a little bit more coconut milk there. Then you'll want to put three-fourths tablespoons of chia seeds, and then however much peanut butter you want. I like to just put about a spoonful so it's less thick, and then some agave nectar or honey to sweeten it up, and some cinnamon and mix it all together. So after you've let it sit all night, um, it's going to kind of be thick like this. And then you just put whatever toppings you want. And then here's breakfast, my pears, my overnight oats, and some water. And I'm eating in my desk because I have class soon. So I might have to eat during class. My accounting class just finished and now I have to rush on over to my digital arts foundation class. I need to be in person today because, well, today's my in-person day and also I have to scan all of my photos so I can put them into Photoshop and work on my project. So we gotta run now because, oh my goodness, class got out late. Um, I have to clean my dishes and run to class. So let's go. So I just got done with my first two classes of the day and I just used a swipe for lunch. So I got pick three 
and so that means you get entree and a drink and a snack but yes yeah, this edamame nut salad and then i got corn ranch doritos and milk sometimes my friends like to have a uh, mac and cheese and they like to use the milk for the mac and cheese or for the hot chocolate this class is my mis class and it is remote so i just put in the discussion board what i'm planning on doing today and then i do it for the time allotted for this class did i say that weird maybe <laughs> Shop studio. This is my friend Bree. We have to build our canvases now, which we are both terrified of doing because we hate this little machine because <laughs> it is kind of scary. But yeah, we're gonna do that now. brought us bagels from her work. Yeah, I did. So that's um, very exciting. There's two snickerdoodle bagels and three plain bagels. <gasps> Yay, bagel haul! Yeah, that I was love the bagel. Haul. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so now I am back. Time for dinner and then I have my meeting at six. Izzy and Grace are gone. They are in Spokane Valley um, seeing family. But Maggie and I are the only ones left. Um, so it's kind of sad though because there's like no one here. I feel like it's so empty. is all ready. Yay! Perfect. So I just finished my meeting and now I have to study for my midterm because as I think I told you guys already I have two midterms back to back next week. So that's kind of scary because I don't want to have to do two midterms in a row. I gotta study for them and gotta prepare so that we can do well. So we're gonna get onto that now. Now I'm going to study for my macroeconomics midterm. So I always create a study plan and I decided I was gonna look at all of my professor's lecture notes, one for every single day until the midterm. Oh, 
well friends that's all i have for you today thank you so much for joining me today i hope that you all have a wonderful rest of your week and that you are being happy and healthy during this time thank you so much for watching again and please be sure to like comment and subscribe if you like the video so yeah bye Thank you.